Welcome back to our everyday living everyone. We're doing a midday pickup. So we are taking what we can. I've gone up to Harvey Norman and asked. So I've got one wash machine on. So we're about to load another one. So yes, that one there we'll put I don't think that'll gonna go up, but we'll put that one up next. Because it's skinnier, yep. then we'll put this one up next. Get as much as we can while we can. If nothing works, well, that doesn't matter. We'll scrap it out. That's scrap metal. It might not fit. <laughs> Screw to light, man. Well. Yeah, might have to put it over here and then put that cabinet in. We're going to grab the cabinet too, everyone. Clean it up. Make it tidy for them. Got a few bubbles in it, but I'm quite sure I should be able to take them out. I'll move this one this way. We've got another big one over there too. So we're gonna load that on the trailer. We've brought the trailer. Yeah. They can go that way. We'll scrap that one out too. Hmm? Scrap metal. We've got a big ass printer here too, we're gonna load. You got it? It is heavy. Up we go. That'll fit right up there. I'm gonna have to lift that up and then I lift this you close that that's it that'll sit like so right now hopefully we can get that 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 and that on the trailer What have we got left? We better put that big one on first, I think. And if we've got to stack it on top of one another, we will. Oh, there's five cents. I'll pick five cents up. The person that doesn't pick up five cents, no. June wouldn't have seen it. Ooh, that's full of yuck. Sit that there. Right, gonna move this one out of the road, put that four cents in pocket. Ow! A burr. I got burred up. Clean this place up for him. I hope it's on wheels. Oh, gee, bloody gee. That's heavy. Close the door. Well, there's a handle down there. Why can't we lift it? What's in it? Bricks. Yep. I'm trying to push down. Oh, Jesus, baby. Here we go. Go like that. Oh, it's got some weight in that one. Oh, screw the light. Yeah. I got it. 
They're going to use the forklift, they're going to call. They're going to pay someone to do it and they don't want to do that. I'm making headway. I've got it from there to here. Right. I've got it from there to here, so I'm making some headway. This has still got the plastic wrap on the front of it. Still got the blue plastic wrap on the front. Hey, hey there. Must have been a display model. Hey, I'm going to try and do this on my own. Oh, okay. I, I said try. I didn't say I was going to. <laughs> I might have to get it up on a pallet. That's not a dumb idea. Put it on a pallet. One of these pallets. Um, the one, the one had the No, no. Put it on this pallet. See if I can get it up on that. That'll help me. Step it up. Yeah, get it higher so I can roll it back. Oh dear. Close the door. Just put your hand up on that. Hey, this is gonna work. Do one big turn from here right around so this is way over there. Yep, that's it, that's it, that's it. Can you just grab the tile board please and put it up? Let it go. Now, I'm just wondering if I put a pallet down there, lay it over. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm thinking everyone. Right. I'm thinking. I'm trying to do the thinking. We lay it over on top. Then we push the pallet in. So that way we're not scratching it. Yeah, we just push it straight over onto that pallet. Hey, don't forget we've got ratchet straps so we can tow it up. Ready? Right. No, because it's on the cord. There we go. We've got to push the pallet, not the thing. Move this one out of the road. Geez, we got some electrics in here. Mm -hmm. Hey, if it don't work, we can strip it down anyway. <coughs> Sometimes it's not worth it. You gonna leave it on the pallet or um, taking it off the pallet? Well, it might be best if it stood up because it takes up a lot of room. So I'm trying to get the pallet in past the tarboard. I don't want the pallet. <sighs> You're hitting everyone. Not even on. Oh. <laughs> Not even on. Let's go show how much June takes. Hey. Oh, I hope that they didn't cut that. Or is it like it? Pull that back that way. This thing probably weighs 110 kgs. Right. Oh, can I have you up here, please? <laughs> 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 oh. 
I got it out, but I can't lift it up. Yeah, you can grab that, it's not coming that way. <sighs> booger. Booger, booger, booger. There you go, there, poopers. <clears throat> Don't go past. I've got to get in there to hold it because you're not on the, you're half on the pallet. I know I'm half on the pallet. You stand on the pallet. Stand on the pallet. Thank you. This black duck knows what he's doing now. Yeah. Taking it off the pallet. Take the pallet out, please. I don't think I could have timed that any better. Look at that. Wow. That's an effort. Bugger. Although I might need to turn it that way to fit that printer in. Ah, oh, bucker. Anyway, I'll do that. Hit the cord up here. Yeah, I've got to go like this. all those hoses down the back. <sighs> this one might work after a while. You just never know with these sort of things. That's a heavy bloody thing. Still looks brand new with the blue strip on it. Blue plastic. Right, um, doesn't matter whether this gets scratched because I'm scrapping it right out anyway. Um, probably best if that faces this side. Alright, come up here, please. Sort of buggered myself lifting that one. It took off. <laughs> you didn't want that, did you? No, I didn't. I'd better take that part. That must be the heavy end. I'm wondering. Oh no, it'll go further down, won't it? Better take the door for it. Alright. Yeah, this one. Take the hoses off it. You tried unscrewing them, did you? Yeah. Oh, there's a small little technique. Turn the turn the hose at the same time the way it done does. Let's hope these two wash machines work. It hasn't got a drain hose, but I've got one at home. These flies are annoying. And we'll take that stove for scrap metal. If we can fit it all on, it looks like we can only fit another two items. But anyway, you got the bottom, or you want the top? It's got some weight in it.
Ready? Ooh. Lighter than what I thought. Oh, I thought it did. No, I thought it did. Yeah. Well, if we put this on its on its end, we'll take those three. No. Because this it doesn't matter if it gets damaged. Because it's only the scrap steel that's in it. And it's best to lay on that end. Got some linear motors and whatever else in there. Come off actually. Look at the water coming out. I hope that's not ink. Oh well. Take that off there. That off there. Yeah. As long as it doesn't land on my head, I'll be right. I can sit it over here. Keep it out of the road. I'll tie that to that side. Right. We'll put the fridge in next. Yep. Because it'll stand up behind that. Gonna empty the juice out of that. <laughs> I said I'll empty the juice out of that. <laughs> you weren't expecting that much, were you? No, I wasn't. <laughs> you got some juice in it. <sighs> Don't want that. Someone's going along and cut the cord already. You got it. Yes, I know it's on wheels. Yeah, I can sit that there, and I can put this on top of that, and the stove over there. Get out of my ear. Right, pull this down. We're almost there. You should be able to carry that on your own. That's 
So if it fits there, look at that. Barely. Barely. What happens if you shut the tailgate up? Yeah, well, I'd, yeah. Hang on. I don't want to break that if I can help it. Uh, oh, bugger. It looks the same that way. Because this washing machine might work. What is this thing? Oh, yeah. We'll just shut the tail board. Shut. Flies. Up and at him. And I'll tie that there. Right. These pellets can go back. That's a pretty good load. That cleaned them up for them, didn't it? Wow. <sighs> old flat screen TV, there's not much in those. There's not much in an old flat screen TV. Nor is there anything in these printers. A bit of stainless and that's about all. Plenty of cords but I didn't bring me snips. Well I can take that one. Take that cord. Yeah, the other part's over there. Angry. Yeah. Go away, fly. That's the other part. Yeah. That goes inside that. Stupid idea, isn't it? Don't well, well, that's what I thought. Yeah. Oh, Anyway, we'll get on out of here, close the gate up. I can't even get out of here now. That's a damn good load. Let's hope those two work. Three work, actually. So let's take it all home. Find out what works and what don't. All right, we've just got home. We've unloaded uh, the TV cabinet and now the washing machine. The top loader of washing machine over here, um, it just needs a bit of testing. It turned on, sounded like the pump worked. Um, we'll put some hoses on it and go from that, see if it'll work before we worry about cleaning it up or anything like that. Now this one here, it's a front loader. We've only just turned it on, June's having a fiddle around with it. It probably only needs a good clean up and we can put it back into the workplace. She was just saying, why throw things out? Yeah, 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 this is much the same as what we had before, what we sold before. We got $250 for. <laughs> so, if we can make a bit of quid of it, we'll make a bit of quid of it. Front loaders, they seem to want to sell. So, some of them just have a blocked up pump. It might be five cents or something like that, and it goes through all of its cycles. Yeah, it's... Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. Well, we've had one of these before. There's no different to this one over here, yeah, really. It all lights up. Yeah, it's so. BioCare. What is it? It's an LG washing machine, 7.5, direct drive, 7.5 kg. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm yet to test all of that over there. Um, I'll do that in a later video. There's two washing machines there I want to test out. These two here. So mind the bit of mayhem and around the place so I want to really test that one out I might be able to get 500 for that if it works if it works this one here might get about $150 you know that makes a good load if I can do that I'm not too worried about the fridge I know it won't work it's got a dint up the top there uh, the stove I know it won't work it's electric so yeah I'm not going to worry about it um, and the printer I'm just going to scrap out anyway so yeah, we're going to pull this off here and um, 
Oh, diddle little um. <laughs> and uh, we're going to put it over with our pile and we'll do two at a time when we can. So, yeah. Isn't it stupid when you can bring a washing machine home, <laughs> plug it in, turn it on, and it works. Love this. Wow! This one over here. I only had to put a hose on this one. Drain hose. <laughs> so that's a bonus for me. Oh, I haven't put it in the hose. Oh, can I have that over here, please? No. <laughs> the drain hose. Now, our PVC drain hose piece. I want it over here, please. Yeah, pull that one out. Pull that one out. Put your phone down so you've got two hands. You won't put your phone down, will you? Right, now put that in there. <laughs> How often can you strike it lucky like that? Like she's working. I've pulled the back off, put a new hose in it, drain hose, and she's working. Anyway, <laughs> that belongs to that. Screw the back on, should be right. This one here, she's a bit old, probably only get 20 bucks for it, but there's a limit switch underneath there. And she doesn't seem to work real good. I'll get two. It does work. It washes, pumps out. I'll get two with the gurney and get in there, really wash the thing up. It has got a broken agitator right here, but that's probably easily replaced. Probably only a $20 part off eBay. It's just that piece there that needs replacing, that top piece. That piece there, because that comes out. She is a bit grotty, but no, nah, 20 bucks is better than taking it to the scrap heap. So, yeah, I say it's scrapped to them, but what I do to it is a different story. Yeah, she's broke right out of there. Look at that. So if um, we can get to and do some research and find out what that's worth. Yeah, that I wouldn't even be able to super glue it back in. But that's not doing the right thing for someone that wants a washing machine. That might be it there, down in there, that's not making it work. Mightn't be contacting in there, that little agitator in there, which is just here. Yeah, I think it'll be that one there. Yeah, there's a little limit switch there, that goes against it, and that'll make it work better. But anyway, that one's working, we're still yet to find out over here. June found out how much that black one is over there. How much you say it was? Nearly two grand. Uh, two and a half thousand dollars. Jesus, the price is going up more and more. It's every time I look at it. <laughs> yeah, so this one over here, this big double, it's a it's a 16 kg front load and a 2 kg top load. Or 2.5 top load. So you can have them both going at the same time. But I reckon it's... Blue, uh, it's got Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, yeah, it's got the technology, man. It's got the light. So uh, we're yet to test that out and get it off. Um, I'll do that probably in the next hour or so, hopefully. Get it all off. So, because I do want to go out and do some more dumpster diving for everyone. Right. Oh, it looks like we've got an on-off switch right there. That's a cool system. Cool idea. We're going to need that on. Ooh, ding, ding, there we go. It's got power. We're going to put it on cold wash. Ooh, she's all lighting up. No, we don't want that. Oh, low level. Low level cold, water, cold. No soak. Beep. I Extra don't know soap. what that's for. Rinse option. Oh, fast. fast. Soak time, no soak, temperature, cold, low level. Is there a quicker one? Uh, fast, fast wash? Fast wash, is it? Well, that's not a fast wash. Go low, cold, it's the same. Very touchy. It is. All right, we'll see if it fills up. Suspense is killing me. You're pressing the wrong one. I've already pressed it. It's thinking about it. 
Give me that. Oh, now you put lid open. Did I turn the tap on? You told me you did. Well, you Tap's did. on now. Doesn't sound like it's filling up. Put your rear over this side. It is, you know. No, I'd hear water. I can hear the water. No, that sounds like air. Have a look. It'll just say lid open. It's got water. It's going got what? Starting to get water in it. No, I hope so. It's probably testing the load. That's what it's doing. It's testing the load. And it's a 9.5 kg simple wash. Easy set. Before it puts water in it. Bring us back shortly. Stop down to 20, 20, it's down to 22 minutes. It sounds like it's trying to spin, doesn't it? Feels like it. It's... Yeah, that's starting to spin. Yeah. Feels like it. Just turn the tap off for me, please. Yeah, it's trying to spin, but I think it's um, got a problem. Might have a problem, this one. She's only spinning slow. Oh dear. It's pumping out okay. Pump's fine. But I can see the rotation of the drum. Yeah. She's not spinning real quick. So the motor might be bugging. Mm -hmm. I reckon it is. Not worth fixing if it's like that. I'll just have a quick look inside. Sit them there. Ooh, it's locked. Yeah, I can't look inside. It locked it. It's locked. Ah! Ah! Child proof. <laughs> adult proof. <laughs> my own. Damn, my fingers. <laughs> it's adult proof. You can't get it out. Bug out. Jam my fingers in that. It's not even going to open the lid on pause. How flaming stupid is that? So the kids won't get in it. Oh, there we go. I can't tell whether that's spinning. Yeah, it still, still says the lid's open. I'm going to... I can't fool the thing either. No, I can't fool it. <laughs> is it? Yeah. It was on 27. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's down at 20. But whether it's spinning properly, it doesn't sound like it. Hard to say. Oh, that one's going to be a project. Uh, that one there, we've got to um, check where the water's where the water's coming from. Mightn't be hard. Take the back off it. Not, yeah. not tipping it upside down. Oh no way! It's too heavy. Too heavy. Um, this one works. This baby works. So does that one. Just a limit switch in there for the lid. And uh, yeah, we'll get these working. 
I've just pulled this apart. Well, I haven't pulled nothing apart. I took the back off, had a look, not too complicated. Tip it up on its side on a pellet, and we've just pulled this out on this big one. Hose was off, that's it. <laughs> Don't know what it is. Sing into the bank. And we don't know what that is. What? Don't you check we've got a filter. Oh, what have we got here? What else we got in here? That, that all looks good to me. Okay. I'm going to tip it up the right way again. Bugger. We'll have another hat. Alright, we've got this one all plugged up, back up, stood up. Turn it on. Oh, I can see a bit better now. Temperature will go cold. No rinse. All right, we go speed for extra. Light on. Drum and lights already on. That's it. Now press the. It's even got a drum clean. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Um. Hold. Uh. Wash. Quick wash. Hold. What's wrong with you now? It's alright. Oh, the door. It's not shut. There we go. Now you got that on 30. Yeah, that's alright. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Because the door wasn't shut properly, got to slam the thing. Right, go okay, quick wash. Long right on. Oh, right. not that it's going to make much difference. We'll see if it leaks out the bottom. The light on. Oh, I can't see whether the light's on. She's a big drum. Like I said, do our bloody dooners. It's still... Still testing it. Yep. Well, we get water. 12 minutes. That's better than that 22 before. We've not got no leakies. The door. Gonna. It's not allowing me. It should. No, it's not. So much for that smart technology where you can chuck it in. Come on. mongrel of a thing don't do that <laughs> we got no instructions on this so we got no instructions whatsoever Yeah, we're filling up there. And this should be able to be in the bottom. Yep. Oh, it's for both. Probably. No, Quick wash. Put the lid down. That's only that. Oh, it probably wants this lid down too. Yeah, that's what it wants. OK, 
Come on, go. It's down. Oh no, you put your other stuff here. Yeah. That might have been what that other cover was. D. 1DC. Don't know what. You'd have to download the manual or do something to find out that. We're just about to test it out. The big one. This is our big tiger blanket that we usually have on our bed. Now it has got on this machine bedding. It's even got outdoor tiger. <laughs> You're all good. We'll put it on um, bedding. Oh, you got to turn it on first, haven't you? I've got to fill these up first. You got that stuff? Be careful because that might want to use the same thing. Soften up. Soften up. Ow, that's hot. Sitting in the sun. Disinfectant. Liquid remove if for remove for powder. Yeah, I'll remove it alright. <laughs> remove the whole thing. That, I think that's what they mean. I don't know. Oh no, you yeah, yeah, well, yeah, you put your powder in there. This is only for your liquid. Yeah, remove tray for powder. So there you go. It has been used before, because you can see the powder, all the liquid powder that they've been using. You're going to put both in, are you? Yep. Top one's working well. You can see the water filling up in there. I hope it comes out on camera. We've done a bit of a fix up with our piping so we can have these two running. We're gonna really test that one out, the one that we had working. And we thought, well, we'll put our blanket in this one. Bedding. Ooh, it goes for an hour and 40. Got it on blanket? Yeah, yeah, I press blanket. See, I'm in the shade. See, bedding. Yep, um, that's on the nine. I'll come along and I'll have a look. It says 30 for that. Well, how about we go 40? We don't want to go any higher because it'll run, make it yeah. run. Two times or three times? Well, I reckon two times rinse. And we'll put it on a very extra spin. It's not going to go. We can only go to high. Oh, that's not necessary. Um, we don't want a bubble soak. Sound on. No. That's it. And that's it. I think it's going to go for an hour and 38 minutes. An hour and 38 minutes. I just said that. Lock the door. It'll test it. See the weight. We haven't got a hot water tap hose connected to it because it should heat its own water anyway. Now it's got a few dents in it, like I mentioned, but that's the only dent I can see. That's probably from us. This one's emptying out. It's only for weights. So we haven't downloaded the manual. We're just going with, we're winging it. You could say. <laughs> See how we go. And it did say, uh, June watched the video. If you want to open this door, you've got to pause this to open that top door. To add more clothes. To add in. more, yeah, to add more clothes, exactly. All right, I'll hop down. Yeah, we can move that. We'll leave that sitting up there. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get to get this one working too. Pull out. Oh dear. Have to in that. Yeah, I know that the 
The darn thing's um, locked us out, Val. Locked us out, you've got it down power. I powered up. It's locked us out because we just shut the... No, just let it go. What's it going to do there? Detecting. It's just detecting, so you might have to let it go. Because we just pulled the pack cords out. Yeah, just pull the cord out. Should open the door. We, sh we should have just stopped it and yeah. Yeah, you can stop it there. There we go. No, sorry, it's not going to work. Even if you turn that off, it's not going to help. Or is that the other one? That's the other one over there. <laughs> so you got to basically let it go. Yeah, mongrel of the machines. Imbecile machine. <laughs> Quick 30. We'll go cold. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. Let it do that. Let it detect and do what it wants to do because the door's locked. It's not going to, it's only going to take half hour. Water's turned on, so it should fill with water. It's detecting whether there's anything in there for weight wise. It's know how much water it's going to add. Geez, an hour and 47 minutes, my bum. Oh, because it's got a rinse on it. Yeah. That's a long time, quick 30. Oh, no, it's going cotton. You can't. Oh, there we go, quick 30. I'll leave it on that. Come on. Here we go. 27 minutes. Don't leave it at that. Because the door's locked, you've got to let it finish. And... Yeah, 27 minutes. So, yeah. We're going to really test these two out. Those two there need a bit of fixing up. The big one here to finish with, I would get this one going. We had a bit of a dilemma with the door locking and staying locked. So I got to pull the bum off it, turned it, had to turn it up on, on side on the milk crate here, and uh, it was a loose connection. So we tested it three or four times before we thought put clothes in it. So yeah, we just put it on spin, and then on the spin cycle, no spin, only went for one minute. So I'd done that about three times. I was able to open the door, so we thought we'd put some clothes in it. Clothes that I found, and uh, give them a good wash. But anyway, the big one up here, with our big doona that we had, has actually finished. So we're giving these a good test run. June's saying if it doesn't clean it, we're getting rid of it. <laughs> hey, it's white. Wait, it's cleaner than what it was. I'll let you know shortly. There you go, there's a white piece. No. Nope. Oh, look, it's a big washer. You'd have to wash it a couple of times. But it's definitely cleaner than what it was. Oh, yes, that's cleaner than what it was. That was brown. Yeah. Yeah, no, that, that does the job. It will tell you on the bottom part, near the feet there. It smells nice. That was brown. That was brown. Look at that. Yeah. That is white now. Yeah. And I don't have to get up there and ring it. No, I don't have to, <laughs> don't have to get in the bathtub and stamp on you it. You would not believe on how many times we've tried to wash this blanket and our other blue one we've got. They're both exactly the same, but one's a blue one, one and this one's the black, as you can see. Uh, We've got up there with the gurney and in, even in here we've got a pole across there and got up there and pressure washed it that way and had to let it drip dry and that sort of thing. And uh, yeah, no, this washing machine, I think it's going to be a God blessed for us 
God saver. So we're just going to go and hang that out. And June said, well, how can I put all your dirty clothes? Jeez, that's light. I was expecting a bit of heaviness. Yeah. No, I'll pass it straight over. That's almost dry. <laughs> I'll come and give you a hand. Uh, yeah, she said, can I put all your dirty clothes in there? I said, yeah, why not? She said, oh, good, I'll get them all over and done with one load. So, yeah, that's what she's going to do. I'll give her a hand to help, help her hang this out. What are we going to do, drape it right over? We're going to stop the other clothes from drying. Yeah, oh, okay. How are we going to do this? It's a big one. Um. Here, we'll go this way. On the opposite side of the clothesline. Yeah. You'll have to go over two lines. Almost went too far. Which way are you going? That way, you pull it straight out that way now. Pull it straight out. Keep going. Yeah. That'll dry like that. That's certainly a lot cleaner than was. All that white there was brown. Brown, brown. Oh, yeah. That's a nice blanket, isn't it? Yeah. That's anyway, um. I don't need pegs. No, you don't need pegs with that. So if you like this video of us testing out washing machines and what we've picked up, that's pretty good. I've still got two over here I've got to sort out and whatnot. So that one there, I'm thinking on hanging on to. June don't want me to hang on to it. And we get rid of this one and that one where we constantly use in there. Because it's a bigger washing machine, we can do our big blankets. And that's what I like. We don't have to worry about going and getting them into the well, dry cleaner. That's the first blanket you ever brought me. Yes, I know it is. But that's the, this is the thing. We don't have to pay a dry cleaner to clean it and it comes out the same as what that is. No, it didn't come out like that. It was dirty. Well, there and you go. It cost go. me $20 to get it done because that's what they quoted. Yeah, well, they yeah. done a shit job, didn't they? We've done a better job than them. But <laughs> the one at Dalby Dry Cleaners, they done a perfect job as well. Yeah, well, we can do it without them now. Yeah. But anyway, if you like our content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, when you subscribe, don't forget to hit the, smash the uh, bell. That way you'll get notified when there's a new video coming out. And June and I, we'll see you in the next video. Cheerio, everyone.